look at that. It's a Buick. It is a Buick. Yeah. 53. Beautiful car. Oh, yeah, it says right on the grill. <laughs> Big old catfish. They were having me for the 50th anniversary. Is that what it is? Beautiful car. It definitely, for sure. Yeah, every fender was handmade on an English grill. Oh, really? Really? Wow. That took some work right there. A lot of curves in that car. Alberta, is that where you're from or is that where you brought it from? Uh, well, I brought it from Alberta. Um, brought it down in the trailer. Very nice. But I'm heading off to Phoenix on Sunday. With it. Are you going to Scottsdale? There. Yeah, I'm going to drive it there. <laughs> All right on. Are you going to put it up? I'm just going to go. Bringing this so you don't bring anything back with you? That's kind of the idea. <laughs> <laughs> Bring back something different, maybe. <laughs> it's gorgeous. I love the shapes of this car. Yeah, from the normal Buick of the year, they brought the windshield down to four inches. So really? So it's kind of chopped the factory. They sectioned two inches out of the body from normal. I love the drop down on the top of the door there. That yeah, the drop down. Uh, what they did is they actually took two different doors, cut them apart, and welded them back together. To oh, get really? Down. How many of these are there? There was 1,100 originally made. 1,100. Sure Handmade Buick. 53. Beautiful. So that year they did three cars. Can I see the engine, Buick. if you don't mind? Yeah, yeah. They did the Buick, the Cadillac, and one other one. I can't remember what it was, but they handmade three cars. It's got... Power steering, power brakes, power windows, power roof, power oh, seats, nice. power radio antenna, and they're all hydraulic. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. It's got to be better than Mercedes where it's all air, vacuum. Yeah. <laughs> hydraulic usually fails, you could find the leak. <laughs> That's right. I love the jar. It was a museum car when I got it. So really? The, the, I haven't touched the body or the seats or anything. It was all done. But the engine was just a really mess. Yeah. And, and probably would have got even more so driving it around. Yeah. From being the dash was missing. Um, so I actually ended up buying uh, three more Buicks. You know how many miles were on it? I what it's got. What it's showing. Uh, I can't see. It looks like 47 on there now. Yeah. Very cool. The only thing I heard people talking about here, it's sitting a little too high. <laughs> <laughs> it, it does. Yeah. I would take it down an inch in the front and two in the back and it'd be perfect. That's just me. But it's a cool car. It does sit high. 